Yeah, and we are now two weeks into the new year. So, how are your New Year's resolutions going? If the answer is not very good, experts say go easy on yourself. Madison is back with us this morning. And, Madison, you spoke with a psychiatrist who says this year shouldn't be the same as in years past. Yeah, New Year's resolutions in 2021 should not look anything like your January 2020 New Year's resolutions. So typically popular resolutions for the new year include losing weight, eating healthier foods, or even managing finances better. But a Baylor College of Medicine professor and executive vice chair of the Department of Psychiatry and Behavioral Sciences says we should stay away from those superficial and unrealistic goals in 2021. If you are too hard on yourself and if you don't give yourself a break and you're too harsh and too hard on yourself and your resolutions are too strict, the chances are that you won't be able to achieve them and in return you can get even more depressed. Resolutions are known for putting pressure on us. In fact, a recent study found that only as many as 50% of adults in the United States even make New Year's resolutions, and then fewer than 10% of those actually keep them for more than a few months. So Dr. Shaw says, allow yourself to relieve some of the stress from 2020 by not placing such high expectations on yourself. Focus instead on goals that improve yourself and your mental health this year. I mean, the best resolutions for 2021 would be A, to take care of yourself, B, to take care of others around you, whether it is your friends, neighbors, and, and near relatives, and C, to stop spreading misinformation. And lastly, if we can work on the last one, which I know is the hardest for a lot of us, is to stop gossiping. And instead of juggling five different resolutions, maybe choose one goal that motivates you to be a better person, affect others, or even create positivity. By the way, Karen, it's not too late to make a resolution for the new year. Any time is a good time, Dr. Shaw says, to take steps towards improving your mental health. So I have to ask, have you made any resolutions for the new year? Mm, you know, it's, I always have really good intentions about, you know, I'm going to lose that five pounds. And I just, yeah, I think I was three or four days in and I just thought, okay, I may, you know, maybe in a month. Well, I'll try. yeah, <laughs> and I always have the same resolution year after year. Uh, my orthodontist would be proud. I always say I'm going to wear my retainers oh. more. <laughs> Unfortunately, I've only done that about three nights so far this year. So we're off to a great start here at CBS 11. Rip-roaring good start. All right, Madison, thank you very much.